So one of the things that uh, is very important for parents is to be aware of conditions that could occur in childhood. For example, childhood diabetes. Parents need to be aware of the symptoms of diabetes. They include urinating a great deal, being extremely thirsty, being tired, maybe weight loss of no known reason. Uh, and if those should occur, the parents should recontact their healthcare providers as soon as possible. And a simple test can be done to kind of include and exclude that. A urine test for glucose is a very simple test that could be done. A finger stick for a blood glucose measurement can also be obtained. Parents should also be aware of their children's growth. They should insist that the growth parameters be reviewed with them by their healthcare providers. That include measurements of height, weight, and body mass index. Body wax index will help identify and hopefully prevent obesity from occurring. It, we don't like to see parents that say, well, the child has been obese, and then we ask them, how long has this been going on? Well, for many years. So the importance is to, as soon as you see a trend towards that, identify that, discuss it with your healthcare provider and see what could be done to prevent it. The same with growth issues. In particular, girls are often neglected for growth issues because they're small, they're cute, they're fine. But in fact, look at their growth chart. Ask your healthcare providers. Make sure they're monitored correctly. A condition that's not very common occurs in one in every two to 3,000 children is a condition called Turner syndrome. Turner syndrome presents with short stature as one of the major features. Frequently, we see these children by about 10 years of age when puberty has failed to occur. But in fact, these children should be identified much before that age because treatment are, is available and treatment should be instituted as soon as the diagnosis is made.